Hello, my name is Carl, W4KRL. I'm a member of the Amateur Radio Research and Development Corporation, AMRAD, and you can find more information about our, our organization on the internet at www.amrad.org. Um, AMRAD is fostering the application of small board microcontrollers into the amateur radio projects. And I've been looking around for a project where I could uh, uh, marry the uh, Arduino process controller board uh, with a useful amateur radio instrument, the Mini VNA. The Mini VNA is a vector network analyzer produced by Mini Radio Solutions out of Germany. And it's a very useful tool to measure antenna, SWR, and other network parameters in the shack or outside. The Mini VNA needs a connected computer to control it and to show the results. And while you can carry a laptop to the base of an antenna with the wires and power supplies and so on, uh, it gets to be a very cumbersome process. So I thought that the Arduino offered the opportunity to directly controlling the VNA uh, in a self-contained unit without needing the, the PC. And to do that, <clears throat> to get both the control and the uh, display, I bought a shield, as is termed in Arduino parlance, uh, which is a touchscreen, full color, liquid crystal display. And this shield plugs in to the standard connectors on the Arduino and provides the uh, touchscreen capability and nice uh, 240 by 320 display capability all in one unit. <clears throat> I bought my unit on eBay for less than $20. Now, I've already programmed the uh, Arduino, so I no longer have to connect it to the computer. All I need is a 9-volt power supply, which is a wall work here, and the unit will power up with the program already installed. What we see <coughs> is uh, the graphical display, uh, which is currently set for the 20-meter band, and we have up and down band buttons here. If I press this, it moves to the 17 meter band, 15 meter band, and so on. It'll go from 160 meters to uh, 2 meters. Um, <clears throat> and you'll notice that each time I touch the screen, the, the graph redraws itself. The auto scaling function that I've built into the software automatically picks a very nicely regulated uh, range of frequencies with the handband of interest highlighted with the gray background and the graph will draw on top of this. So my plan is to marry these two instruments together and make the VNA a completely self-contained unit. And I hope to show further progress in a subsequent uh, video. And uh, you can monitor the progress on YouTube and on www.w4krl.com. Thank you.